Government departments are being ordered to cut spending by 2% next financial year. The Treasurer, Christian Porter, says WA needs to find a billion dollars over the next four years to cover the loss of GST revenue. Health, education, law and order. No department is safe from the cuts. The Treasurer says the state was forced to trim the fat because the Gillard government has slashed WA of GST revenue. We're predicting the Back to the GST, that storm is no longer on us. Two percent is to be slashed from sector budgets from 2012-13. Further one percent for the following three years. Hunting for waste inside the public sector is very, very volatile ground at the moment. Too many parking bays, too many vehicles, too much corporate travel. At corporate events, government business synergy won't escape the cuts either. The treasurer says infrastructure will be deferred but the stadium and waterfront projects won't be affected. While there's a promise of no job losses or impact on frontline services, unions aren't buying it. We know that it will be frontline services that are affected. What it will mean is reduced services, reduced standards. Education gets a partial exemption with an initial 1% cut instead of 2. To have been cut to the bone and you know there really isn't any fat left we believe in education. Western Australians will suffer cuts to their frontline services as a result of this cheap trick uh, by Colin Barnett and Christian Porter. As part of the billion dollar savings plan, there will also be a two year freeze on all new jobs across the public sector, except for frontline services in health, police and education. Michael Bitt, 10 News.